The body of 13-year-old Madeline Soto was found on Friday after she was reported missing by her mother. The prime suspect is the mother's boyfriend, Stefan Stearns. He was arrested two days before her body was found. Caitlin Becker has been following the story all along. Caitlin, an arrest made before the body was found. This seemed pretty unusual. Break it down. It is, Hannah. The timeline here is a little bit weird. So she was reported missing on Monday. He was arrested on Wednesday, and her body was found on Friday. Now, he wasn't arrested for anything having to do with her disappearance or even her killing. He was arrested by police and taken into custody on charges of sexual battery and possession of child abuse material after they found disturbing images on his phone. Now, police did not go so far to say as to whether or not Madeline was the alleged victim of this abuse. However, they did say the abuse happened at home. And investigators said on Wednesday when they arrested him that they were confident at that point that Madeline was in fact dead. She was still missing at the time. So it seems like they had put together quite a bit of evidence at that point. What do investigators think happened? Well, they don't believe that Madeline made it to school that day and that Stearns was the last person to see her alive. The timeline here is very, very short. They believe she died quickly after leaving that morning. He was spotted allegedly coming home around 8, 19 a.m. with Soto visible in the vehicle. And I do anticipate that we're going to get some more charges coming at us. What you're seeing here is the scene where her body was found. It was found in a wooded area a few mm. days later. But I do, anticipate, I do anticipate quite a few more charges, including possibly homicide and even maybe tampering with evidence or destruction of evidence because police also say that they have footage of him tossing items into a dumpster around 7 something in the morning that came back to be allegedly her backpack and belongings. Oh, such a disturbing case. Thank you for that update, Caitlin. Thanks for watching. Go to joinnn.com to find News Nation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact driven, unbiased coverage.